Back to the very beginning, because uh, you were uh, a youngster and you had this dream of becoming a, well, a, a worldwide superstar, right? Yeah, that that was my childhood dream. That that was always it. Yeah. Uh, Could you I, say the dream is coming true now? I'm I'm living the dream. Yeah. I am. I'm really living the dream. And and I'm gonna tell the truth, it's beyond the dream because it's more than I, than I. It, The things that I'm doing is bigger than the dream, the vision that I had. Yeah. So, um, but it's 50 uh, years later uh, or something, right? Well, it's been yeah, quite a road, uh, quite a ride. Quite a long journey. Yeah. But at the same time, that says that if you, the the secret to success is a winner never quit, and a quitter never win. Wouldn't ask to borrow anything. Fix the chain. Picked up, uh, so to say, and yeah, just uh, to make it short, there was after making these first recordings, there was Dan Auerbach of the Black Keys, right. uh, a legend, uh, yeah. a modern music legend. Right. How was that? That he was? Man, I did not know. I did not know who he was. I had not heard of him because I've been in my little box. Yeah. You know how you say you're in your comfort zone. Yeah. Uh, but uh, he heard me, and he reached out to people to. Uh, that he wanted to meet me. And the next thing I knew, they was calling me to go to his studio to see if I wanted to do the voiceover on a book yeah. called Murder Banner. Yeah. And I think we had four days to do that, four songs. Mm -hmm. And we were shooting at a, at a song a day. And uh, we started that morning about 10 o'clock. And uh, by four or five o'clock that evening, We had did all four of the songs, yeah. and we still had three more days of yeah. studio time in the budget. So then that's when Dan says, hey man, you want to sing an album while you're here, you know? So he pulls out all these songs. Get it. 
Good night.